Hi there, it's Phil from parkerlings.com. I hope you're all having a great time in your garden. Now, I am here to show you a little update in regards to the cucumbers, uh, where we did a little test just to say, well, we're in the last couple of months of the growing season. Is it worthwhile from seed doing new cucumbers? Uh, we are just on the borderline of doing it, so give it a shot. That's what I did, and I'm gonna show you where we are, both from the ones that I've put into the soil and also ones that I forgot to put in the soil because, I, well, I forgot, what can you say? I'm gonna show you this now. Have a look and we'll see if it's worthwhile doing it this time of year. Okay, that's a marigold, but hey ho, it's growing on its own out there. Uh, now we have here one pooped on um, Market Mall 76. That's one from my own seeds. Nice. This is my own as well. And as you can see, it's done all right. There was a bit of a chomp there, um, but not to worry. And here's one of the shop bought Market Malls. That's doing well. Nice. So that's pretty good. They're happy. But let's go on a walk around, shall we? Go past this lot. So here's... Ah. You've got one leaf. That one's completely gone. It's been eaten. Let's go around. This is another one. National pickling cucumber. Gone. Uh, where are we? Let's have a look. So we have dragon's egg. <coughs> Nothing. Uh, let's jump through here. What we got here? Uh, doo -doo -doo. Nothing going on. Ah, dragon's egg. Nothing. <coughs> okay. What else we got? National pickling. That's actually been bitten. You can see there, it's been chomped off. That's why it's all gone dead. That's no good. And that was in fact my courgette, which was eaten. Just wander around here quick. Close that because the dog's around. Okay, pick a bushel again. National pickling, not even been in the ground yet. And you can see that it's been just taken off again. There, this is a market moor. These have been wet. Uh, see, Genevieve's basil is still fine. The zinnias are fine and everything, but again here, market moss. Chomped. That one's gone dodgy, but not good. Not good at all. And as you can see, these are two of the other ones that took out the ground. We're probably in agreement here. That test did not go particularly well. But I do still have the free market moss 76 cucumbers. Um, strangely, all of the ones I've got left are all in the same space, so you know, that's a good thing. I can actually cover them with some form of netting, maybe. Stop the cucumber beetles getting in. Uh, stop the cabbage white butterflies now, because they're coming through as well. Any slugs, uh, although they, if they're in the ground, they'll come up anyway. But um, also, hopefully I can stop squirrels. We'll see what happens. But um, what I did also have there, as you'll have seen, they didn't do well in the trays, but I had courgettes. Or zucchinis. Now they were put into the raised beds as well and I want to show you how they're doing. Uh, now I can tell you for sure they are not as bad as the cucumbers. We do have some courgettes left so let me show you how they're doing. Well here's the first one. It's Black Beauty. You can even see there there's a load of buds coming through so that is really nice. Nice. So if we come around here, hope I'm not making you dizzy. Uh, another Black Beauty here. Again, looking good. Nice. Again, more buds. Come around. Didn't plant so many of these, but another black beauty. Nice. And looking good. There's a few little nibbles in there though. 
Oh, look at that. That one's picking up a bit of height as well. Nice. And over here, this is the Italian ribbed. Nice. It's looking very good indeed. I think we're going to have some buds on that soon. And uh, let's see. And we also have, ah, that one's not so good. As you can probably see there, it's been chomped up a whole load of it, but it is still alive. There is still leaves in there in the middle. So there's still a chance. Nice. So there you go. I think we have a chance. We might be able to get some uh, courgettes out of this. You know, it's not the main part of the plan. The main part was the cucumbers, but I'm glad I did that as well. Again, it's another test. We'll see what happens. Obviously, if it goes well, in a few weeks, I'll let you know, I'll give you an update. If it doesn't go particularly well and goes the way of the cucumbers, what I'll end up doing is giving you an update a lot quicker and ending the video like that. We'll see what happens. It's only a few C's, I'm not too bothered. But hopefully this is something that you can try as well. Uh, I know in hotter countries or hotter states uh, that continue the growing season further on, say for, for the states like California, Florida, places like that, it's still something that you can carry on and do more than likely. So it might be worth giving it a shot. Let us know how it has, put some notes down below and that'd be really good. Love to know how it's going for you and where you are. Uh, definitely your growing zone, love to know that. So on that note then, we are really hoping that it works. Let's hope. Uh, but uh, if you did enjoy this video, please do press that thumbs up button to say you like it and uh, share it, it'd be fantastic. But if you want to do everything for us, if you want to subscribe, that'd be fantastic. We are getting closer to our next stage, We're getting to that 500 mark. Hopefully we can do that soon. Um, with your help, we can. And for all of our, for all of our current subscribers, thank you very much for staying with us there. We really love that you watch our videos and that you make comments. Uh, thank you so much. Uh, you're making this uh, really worthwhile that we can see that these numbers are going up and videos are being viewed. So everyone, thanks again. You take care. Goodbye and God bless. Bye-bye.